So next, the same way, we'll see question number eight. Here we have the question is like this. So we have to draw pie chart. So first of all, the same way, you plus them all. 8 plus 7, 15, 15, 19, 19, 20, 14, 15, 19, 22, 24. So total 24. To get the uncle component, so we take each fraction, we divide by 24, we multiply with the uncle 360. So here you get 8, divide 24, 3. 3 into here 120 so the first uncle is 120 degree then here uh, we can divide with 6 6 into 60 6 into <coughs> 4 then 4 into 1 4 24 5 so 7 5 sa 35 7 1 7 plus 3 10 so the second uncle is 100 5 so we can see that 24 divide here we get 15 4 into 5 20 4 1 4 5 6 then 24 divide here 15 3 5 sa 15 3 1 3 4 okay then 24 divide this one we get 15 2 into 5 30 there so we get the uncle component then if you want to find the percentage you can take this one either you take whole divide with 100 you can do either way okay you can do this one into 100 or you can take the uncle divide by 360 into 100 whatever you do it will come to the same way okay so this one we want to convert to percent so here you can cancel zero with zero then 12 divided 36 we get three so here 10 into 10 100 100 divided by three you will get 33.3 then here you have zero zero then there okay so here you can cancel with 3 can we 3 into 3 9 3 into 5 15 3 into 12 then you multiply 3 5 0 divide by 12 okay whatever you get that will be the answer please complete yourself this one then here also 0 0 6 into 6 so 100 if you divide by 6 will get 1 6 point something no need to take many you can take only <coughs> one number after decimal here if we go with <clears throat> 9 no 9 into 5 9 into 4 0 0 we can cancel so 50 divided by 4 then here 0 0 3 into 12 so 100 divided by 12 see what you get <clears throat> divide yourself 0 0 12 into 3 divide yourself if they not come to an end you take at least two uh, one number after decimals okay then when we finish, now you can draw the pie chart. So how to draw? First of all, take the compass and draw the circle. Then you mark one line. So remember, the first uncle we have is here also we have 120, right? <clears throat> so put the center of protector at the center of the circle. Then that line which you draw, make it coincide with zero. So we have to take the lower scale. That is equal to 120. Okay. Remove the protector. Join it. But join only up to the boundary. Then here you write 120. You put some symbol. That will be for school. Then the next angle is 105. Twist your protector. So that the arm of 120 will coincide with 0. And the center of protector should be at the center of circle. So here you can see we take the lower scale up to 105. So from 100 you count 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Okay. Mark it like that. Then you draw like that. So but join only up to the boundary. Clear. Then next is 60. So you
So from here we will make it 60 there. Okay, so there. Same way you join. So here also you write angle 60. Then make some symbol. Okay, this is for homework. The next one we have is 30 degree. Twist the protector. Okay, to go along with the arm of 60. From here. Then from there you can see up to 30 here. Then from here, this one. Okay, here is 30 degree. So those. Then automatically this one, it will be the last degree. So you <clears throat> do the same thing. You put the symbol, then you draw by the side, okay? So like that, I use symbol dot dot here. So you write dot dot, that is for school. There also. But you can use your own symbol, okay? You may not follow like this. So with this, we come to an end.